Now, Pope Francis called for an immediate ceasefire in Gaza and the release of all Israeli hostages in an Easter address that marked the most important day of the Christian calendar by deploring the suffering caused by wars. Francis has uh, repeatedly deplored the death and destruction in the Gaza war and has renewed his call for a ceasefire. He also condemned human trafficking and prayed for a path of hope for those suffering from violence, hunger and the effects of climate change, as well as uh, consolation for the victims of terrorism in all its forms. Joining us at this point of time is Mr. Sanjeev Shavastav, international affairs expert. So a very good morning to you and thank you so much for speaking to us on News X. Now, what do you make uh, of these statements that have, made, that have been made by Pope Francis? Well, uh, as always, first of all, a very good morning to you. Good morning to all the viewers. You know, uh, this is a, a, a significant uh, statement uh, uh, which has come from uh, uh, Pope Francis. And uh, certainly at this point of time, there is a uh, need uh, for an uh, immediate ceasefire in Gaza uh, because the uh, situation, humanitarian crisis, is uh, worsening out there and uh, people must get some relief, uh, some respite from this uh, ongoing uh, war uh, between the two sides. And uh, obviously, uh, at this point of time, uh, uh, it is, is essential to address this uh, humanitarian crisis. And for to do that, a uh, ceasefire uh, would be uh, essential, and that is what uh, Pro Francis has appealed uh, uh, from the uh, to both sides. Also, he is uh, uh, of the view, and he, is, uh, he has appealed that the hostages, uh, which are there in Hamas's uh, captivity, uh, must also be released. And uh, uh, and uh, obviously, these are very constructive, positive uh, statements uh, which are uh, uh, which has come out from Pro Francis. But at the same time, uh, you know, uh, as far as uh, both the sides are concerned, obviously the, there is a need for ceasefire. But Israel is also, you know, uh, uh, very much uh, uh, determined to defeat Hamas uh, completely, and uh, they are fighting a war against terrorism. Uh, and uh, uh, that kind of, uh, you know, future war of Israel uh, is uh, likely to continue. But at this point of time, if uh, ceasefire happens then it will be uh, good for the entire uh, 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 situation and uh, it will give some respite uh, uh, to the people of Gaza and, uh, and uh, for Israel also, I think it will uh, give them some, some time but at, uh, 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 to re-exercise and to come up uh, with a better plan. So I think uh, at this point of time, the ceasefire is essential and that is what uh, our pro Francis has appealed for. But let's see uh, what kind of uh, impact it does. It makes on the warring sides uh, in Gaza. That is that is yet to be seen. But these are certainly a very constructive, positive, you know, remark and appeal by Pope Francis. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon.